Hi everyone, um, today I will be talking about the book Blackbird Fly by Erin Entrada Kelly. Um, it's an amazing book. It provides a great sense of a mirror for students who are from Filipino heritage or really of any heritage that's not widely represented um, because Apple shows that no matter what happens in her life, she's going to value her culture and um, do her best in life. <clears throat> so let's get into the summary. So um, this book is about a 12-year-old girl named Apple who struggles with being different from her peers, um, specifically in terms of how she handles her Filipino heritage and the fact that she looks different from everyone else around her. There aren't any other Filipino students in her school, so she feels as if she's kind of the black sheep of the herd. Um, Apple dreams of becoming a famous rock star someday, but doesn't have the money to buy her own guitar, so it's hard for her to express herself, and her mother feels like she wants to do the best that she can for Apple, but she just doesn't have the money. So this book also appeals to um, a sense of a mirror for students who come from lower socioeconomic status families. Um, it helps them understand why their parents can't afford things. Um, so Apple turns to music and she does it to express herself and eventually learns that she is important and valuable no matter what she does in life, no matter how much money her family has, no matter what her culture is. Um, she just learns to value her life. So let's get into some guiding questions for this book. Um, before you read the book, judging from the cover art, I want you to take a look and think about what the book will be about. Um, do you think it's going to be about, you know, a upper white middle class uh, girl who thinks that she wants to be a rock star or, you know, you just kind of have to use your imagination. Um, this book is really interesting for students grades three through seven, but... Um, it might be difficult for students who are under fifth grade to understand just because of some of the words that are used, their um, upper vocabulary. Um, this book is realistic fiction and it cont contains great themes of ima imagination, new life experiences, different life experiences, and the concept of individuality. So I really, really hope that you read this book. It was one of my favorites. I say that about every book. Every book I read is one of my favorites. Um, but yeah, definitely take a chance to check it out when you get some time. And it's a great read aloud book for the classroom.